Hello and welcome to highlights of the women's team time trial from Vogada in the west of Sweden. The first time this race has been run since 2019. Back then it was Trek Segafredo who took the title. 12 teams on the start line starting three minutes apart. Starting off with Parkatel of Valkenberg, they'll be followed by Coop High Tech Products with Trek Segafredo and SD Works, the final two teams to start. The first of two races on the Sweden weekend, heading out of Vagada and then out along an undulating fast course where they'll have the wind behind them to Heljunga, where they have the first intermediate time check as they pass through the streets and then it's back into the wind with a 27.1 kilometer intermediate time check before some twists and turns into the town. Park Hotel of Valkenberg with three riders fresh from the Tour de France Femme were a well-drilled uh, squad and they came in to the finish to set the benchmark time of 47 minutes and 22 seconds. Team Jumbo Visma were managing their resources well. They had a provisional fastest time after 15.7 kilometers and they finished with a new fastest time of 46 minutes and 11 seconds. Always fast against the clock and former world champions team DSM. Despite losing Elise Oyen on the course, they would go through the intermediate time check with 17 minutes and 58 seconds. At the line, another fastest time with 45 minutes and 45 seconds. Canyon SRAM, multiple times they have won the Volgada team time trial and multiple times world champions. And with Elena Amia Lusik on her road bike, they came in in 46 minutes and 58 seconds. Amia Lusik's road bike not making it over on the flight trek. Sega Fredo defending champions got off to a good start, but unfortunately, a front wheel puncture for Loretta Hansen took the squad down and they would then lose Chloe Hosking leaving Audrey Cordon Rago, Ellen Van Dyke, Sharon Van Anroy and Emily Deirdrickson. It would be a blistering time at the finish for Trek Segafredo coming home in the time of 44 minutes and 56 seconds with just Team SD Works to finish. A quick debrief from Director Sportive, Ina Teutenberg. Could SD Works go quicker? The last team off the ramp and a star studied lineup with runner up in the Tour de France fam and Queen of the Mountains, Damie Vollering, who was clearly looking strong. They would be within 10 to 15 seconds of Trek Sega Fredo throughout the course. Coming in towards the town of Vagoda and up towards the finish, there would be a little error for Damie Vollering as she followed the motorbike, but quickly corrected by the rest of her team in towards the finish. And a time of 45 minutes and 34 seconds, it was good enough for second place. Trek Segafredo made their way to the podium. Another well-drilled team time trial before us, and you would expect nothing less. 44 minutes, 56 seconds, taking it from SD Works and DSM. Great finishes for Yumbo Visma and FDJ Suez Batura Scope. One of the rides of the day, though, Parkatel of Valkenberg in seventh. The Trek Sega Fredo will go into the road race tomorrow with some great confidence. After the team time trial, which is a lesson in pain and suffering, they have 125.7 kilometers to come on Sunday. It's come down to a bunch sprint in the past. Could it be a day for the breakaways? It always gives us exciting racing.